Okay, YouTubers. Gonna show you a little few things here. There's a little redwood work. My persim persimmons. It's all redwood. It's all redwood. <coughs> little shed I'm gonna make in my solar control house. In my little apartment. It used to be an ugly garage, but it ain't ugly no more. So, here's the old solar hot water tank, my free summer hot water tank. I've just taken it apart. It's November and I'm getting ready to leave the country. So, till May. So, that's That's a leak. I'll have to fix that. I've taken everything apart. And I'm going to run the lines now straight back, three quarter when I get back. And uh, gonna have to fix that. And I've got an indoor, a friend of mine gave me an indoor hot water, on demand hot water tank. Bosch, I think it's a 2400 or 4200 or something. And I'm going to put it, so I'm going to replumb everything. It's going straight back into here three quarter instead of the copper, half inch copper. It's going to go back underneath. And like I said, this was five bucks for the tank and twenty dollars for the copper. I get the washing machine hoses, you know, a dollar wherever. And that's gonna go underneath the sink. My lines are gonna come back underneath here. This is my kitchen, outside kitchen. And um, yes, I did the dishes. So here's my little six gallon Ace Hardware hot water tank. There's my um, manifold I made. And uh, it's leaking. So um, it's not leaking, it's on the outside. So um, that's what I'm doing. I get free hot water all summer long and um, where I just caught PG&E stealing my gas from their new meter which I put all my bills on XL never used XL before so I put all my bills my electric bills for the last 10 years on XL and as soon as they put their smart gas meter up I um, my meter, my electric gas usage went up 12 times, 1200 percent. So as soon as I, um, as soon as I contacted turn.org, T-U-R-N.org, and filed a complaint with them and the PUC immediately in California, and they asked me if I had any documents, I remembered I had that and I shipped that off, 10 years worth of, of bills, which you can graph, of usage you can graph, and uh, I'm not a really Excel person, but, and uh, within two days they were, they were telling me they were contacting PG&E, PG&E called me up, they wanted me to get off, they offered me to get off the smart meter. They couldn't get rid of me fast enough. So now, since, um, I'm going to check my electric meter. I have my own electric meter and I just purchased two gas meters for myself. So I'm going to stick a new gas meter, my gas meter, right behind theirs and we're going to go back to the analog days because you can no longer trust anybody or any corporation. 
And you cannot, you, I, I found out that, you know, I cannot trust PG&E. They're, they're ripping me off for $5 a month. And so now I'm going to check the, um, their electric meter versus mine. So I'm, they were more concerned about my pilot lights now after, well, since 1995 when I had gas put up the street. I got seven neighbors together, a quarter mile worth of gas. Now they're worried about my, my pilot lights might be using 12 times as much and they wanted to come in my house and give me an audit. When I have a, a 20 inch stove, a 20 inch gas stove, and the only pilot light is in the oven, and I have a um, 10,000 BTU Empire wall heater. So, I mean, you know, that's all I have. So, I think that I'm going to write, I'm going to try to write the uh, PUC and uh, if, if I convert back, that means my complaint is virtually over, but it's not because, you know, other people have, uh, they're doing it to 20 million other people and at $5 a month, that's 20 that's a hundred thousand dollars a month. Uh, no, that's a hundred million dollars a month. And if you multiply that times twelve, that's one point two billion dollars a year they're getting. They're stealing from the public. Um, you and I, that I know of. I haven't checked my electrical meter, but I'm going to be doing that. So, this is my. Um, my little uh, free solar hot water. I get all my hot water in the summer months from that passive solar tank. So um, I'm going to revamp it next year and do all my own plumbing. I cut thread pipe and I do all my own work because I can't afford a, a, a plumber and you know who can. And um, I'm going to put in the um, on-demand hot water tank, natural gas hot water and uh, we'll, we'll make another video when that's up next year. So I redid this one because you guys comp complained, but it was free, cheap, and too easy to do while I was doing the plumbing and uh, new water line. And so I got to go.